so now let's see how we can use widgets uh, we how we could write our own widgets inside the custom code and add those widgets inside our actual application uh, in the ui so for that what we will do um let me just close it down and i will what i will do is like i will just create a rectangle which is going to be a kind of like a window to what you are creating it will show it inside it as a child so this is just a rectangle right now uh, you would think of it like a container so uh, what i will do is i will just do an add logic to it so we will just pass the widget as a child from a uh, insert code so for that i will just remove this and i will just open the add code and i will create a new file uh, and let's say my custom widget dot dot so over here uh, what i have done is like i've uh, got this uh, ui from chat gpt i'll just copy it it's just a simple ui and i will just paste it over here and apart from that um yeah so what we are going to do is like we are just going to use this we don't need the main but what we need is the my app okay so to use this let me just call it my app so that it doesn't conflict with other app uh, names so or i could just call it close it and for now um i would just go here and search for my widget be my app one pass this uh, object inside as a child it will not take it because the matching is not this for this what we will do is like i will i will just create a function and just make it widget and call it my child and return For now let's just close it over here you can go out this one and see the my child and pass this widget inside as a child and now you have this one this is we don't need it that is all there is to it just run it and see this is simple ui this is the whole code that we have got on the chat gpt so for now uh, because this is a small ui and it says it overflows so what we could do is just expand this container so that it then becomes a problem uh, by doing so click on this one you could see this is the ui and click on it so that's how you can draw your own uh, ui inside the uh, designer and this is very useful if you're trying to get anything custom thing the way you want it what you just need to do is uh just go over here add your widget uh, that you have trying to build create this kind of a method which says widget you can name it anything and return that widget that you have just created the app the one that i've created pass it into the main child and when I go back over here, this is the insert code. I just call this widget uh, from the main child and I just pass it inside the rectangle, which is this one. Just right click on it, add logic. It will appear here. Pass it inside the child, uh, the widget value and connect these two nodes. And that is it uh, in what you have to do and it will build itself. So yeah, uh, that is all in this video. And in the next video, we will talk about the third party libraries. And in the subsequent one, I think we will talk more about other things. See you in the next video. So yeah, bye bye.